Quite often we get asked uh, that um, they'd like to have their hatch doors or their tunnel boot doors uh, level with the floor so it's uh, quite easily to uh, sweep out uh, any debris that might be inside after camping. So uh, we get asked that, can that happen? Can that be made flush to the floor? Well the answer is yes and this is how it's done. Okay, well you can see here that uh, with this uh, tunnel boot that we've got the Styro Seal LT bottom doorway extrusion piece nice and flush with the floor. You now there's a uh, bit of a trick that's got to happen here. Um, I can show you that. Uh, whereas we actually uh, use the, um, the bottom piece as a Z section uh, and, and don't turn it into a C section. So. In other words, what we do is we leave the, uh, we leave the back leg out uh, when we're installing this. So um, I'll show you how that's done. If you see here when I talk about uh, a C-section, so we'll put the, uh, the main door piece on and then we'll turn it into a C-section with this uh, drop-in leg. So the actual piece is, uh, goes into past the panel the thickness of itself. So um, when I say that uh, we remove the, um, the back leg and don't use it, what you end up with uh, in a Z section situation is that this trim still goes past the panel, the thickness of itself, so it's uh, 1.6 mil. So basically what that means is you have to cut a relief into your floor 1.6 mil to allow this trim to come past the panel so you can actually apply the adhesive uh, to the top of the panel and then to the back of the trim which then goes up against your floor. Yeah, as you can see that uh, this piece has been bonded to the uh, top of the, uh, the door cutout. And we've also applied adhesive to the back of the trim, which is uh, bonded up against the floor sheeting. 